Hi guys and welcome back to my Color Beauty channel. My name's Emma and today we are playing the new Hitman game. It's absolutely brilliant. Um, it's a bit like the old one um, but there's, the maps are a lot bigger and I can't wait till the next mission comes out because I've already completed what's available to do. So yeah, let's get on with the game. So this is uh, the first two uh, missions are training so this one you have to kill this guy on the boat so I just basically get a mechanics outfit and drag his ass into the bathroom and dump that bitch <laughs> Yeah, you don't want to get spotted, so just stay well clear of the guys. Get the rat poison. Even though I've put the rat poison in a few different places, like a drink and a stew pot, and I haven't seen them eat it or drink it. So I'm going to have to replay it and see what happens. So yeah, take the chef's outfit or waiter's outfit shove him in the fridge, freezer, whatever it is pop the rat poison in there even though they don't want to eat it and stay well clear of other waiters and things pop upstairs and he, the guy we need to kill comes in here but it takes ages see the red outline is him who I need to kill but it takes absolutely ages to come upstairs so I have to use a different angle so what I'm gonna do is go upstairs and shoot him from the helipad there's a million and one ways to kill this guy and I'm going to keep replaying it and checking out the different ways but just to get through this walkthrough I'm just going to show you like the most easiest way to do it and that guard is doing my head in so I'm going to kill him keeps looking at me and I need to kill him Subdue, subdue. Drag his ass into the control room. And then you want to get your silencer out. See, if you were under that barrel, I could have just dropped that barrel on his head, but too busy yapping and won't move. So. Make sure no one sees you. Get your silencer. You want a good headshot. There you go. Now you want to hide. So change into his outfit and get the hell out of there. <laughs> but he's going to recognize you, so I'd quickly switch back. <laughs> Didn't expect them to come upstairs actually. You just want to get your ass out of there, man. Don't worry, didn't do anything. I'm leaving, I'm leaving. So go back in there and get your mechanics outfit. And straight back down. So that's pretty much like the easiest way, the quickest way to kill him. Unless there's a new way that you know. Now I just walk back to the car and you're done. So now you've got to go through this training mission again but kill him in a different way. But rather than show you that I'm just going to go absolutely crazy and kill everybody on the map. Because that's what I do. Because when I've completed a mission 
how it's supposed to be completed what I'll do is I go back and kill every single person on the map as a challenge to myself and maybe go back again and kill the guy without hurting anybody at all because when I first do the missions I'll just get through it as best I can I'll probably kill a few people and then I'll just go back kill everybody and then go back again and just kill the person you're supposed to because I get bored and I need to make it more exciting <laughs> so rather than me ramble on of what I'm doing I'm just gonna show you what I'm doing so enjoy the crazy massacre And just to quickly mention, I do apologise for the quality of this video. Uh, I haven't figured out how to record my gameplay and edit and upload. So I'm just basically filming my TV. So yeah. But you get the gist.
So now this is the second part of the training exercise and this is um, at a military air base I think, could be wrong but whatever. So what you do is uh, you listen to do these two guys who are the uh, flight engineers or safety protocol engineers, I don't know, and you want to rig it so that when the guy gets in it to do the safety procedures gets flown out of the ejector seat. So what I do is sneak over to this guard, get my coin out, throw it to get his attention so that he can sneak up to him and take his clues and dump his ass in that box. So now what you do want to do is make your way over to the entrance of the building. Try not to look suspicious. And that is the safety manual for the jet. So you want to rig the ejector seat. So you need a mechanics outfit. Pop him in the box and make him go nanite. Make sure to pick up the wrench and make your way over to the jet and tamper with the eject seat. So now you want to find out where your target is. So he's upstairs so make your way upstairs go directly to him and if you chat to him you can basically tell him that he needs to follow you to the jet for the safety protocol and he can be a bit of a funny bugger so you need to make sure that he follows you downstairs. So you've taken him to the jet and you pick up the safety manual and Hitman will basically go through step by step what he needs to do and he will pull the lever and shoot his ass out of the jet which is so funny. Sayonara bitch. Right, so now you've uh, killed him, you need to make your way back to where you subdued the mechanic, swap back into a guard's outfit and make your way to the exit. Yeah, so this is the last training mission. The next mission is really good, you've got to kill two people. It's in a Paris catwalk, which is awesome, very big map lots of different ways to kill each person so I will show you that in my next video so do like and subscribe and I will see you next time take care bye